Oh, I love it. That's gonna be so convenient. As y'all know, we are truck drivers, so we then had um, shower flip flops on deck. Everybody was like, "No bare feet in the shower." I'm like, "Y'all, we 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 ain't new to this." Okay, very true to this. This is my first time ever parking at one of these. I know they used to have these at Toys R Us, but the Toys R Us in my hometown closed, and obviously I wasn't pregnant back then. But look at me being able to park and the expected mothers. Mama needed a break from sitting on that floor, baby, okay? Being pregnant with the legs and the back and all that going on. So we came to Bye Bye Baby because nesting includes getting everything the baby needs and we ain't got a stroller yet. <laughs> a car seat or a stroller yet. We came specifically for the car seat and stroller and at Bye Bye Baby they have the Duna, which we are heavily interested in. So I wanna look at that open it up and down and kind of see what it's hidden for so we can see if we love it. Me and my homegirls are upset because they didn't have the Duna here, which is the only reason we came, but they got some cribs and some other stuff that we're looking at, so. In the spirit of nesting, I just took my inventory sheet back to the leasing office and they have a Starbucks machine over there, so I just got a cup of some hot water so I can take my raspberry leaf tea. If you know, you know. Good morning, it is the next day. So yesterday we didn't end up finishing everything and putting everything together like I wanted to, but things happen, it gets busy, whatever. Um, so it's the next day and I'm about to get ready to drink my raspberry leaf tea again. There was a super heavy bag at our first baby shower and it had a lot of gifts in it. Celeste, you the real MVP. Um, but she also got us this cup set and so I'm about to use this. I'm gonna wash these out real quick and I'm gonna use this to drink my tea today. We went to Walmart yesterday. I got this planner. We also got this, um, calendar that we can like hang up. So we can just write everything down and be able to see it in front of us. This one I'm gonna mostly use for content and stuff, but this one we're gonna use for like anything, household bills, appointments, stuff like that. Hi, please, how cute is this? It's pink on the inside and Jeremiah's is blue. I'm currently at Dollar Tree. Just a couple of more stops before we get back to the house. And I have to finish putting all this stuff together. So I have some of these little buckets that we got the other day. These are actually a little bit bigger. These might be better. The ones that I have, I think are these, but these ones are a little bit bigger. I think I'm gonna get a couple of more of these because now that I've sorted through all that stuff, I realize we got a little more stuff than I thought. <laughs> Pause break so we can get our furniture delivered. It look good and it's not even no light in here so we think we might get a lamp um i mean there's a light over here on the side where the wet bar is that one but we i feel like a lamp would look good behind here that blue is hitting is hitting and i might go and get another pillow you see how the the pillows have this little like different colored texture on there i might go and find like a light blue or a light gray pillow just to fill that in and like a little throw blanket for either the corner over here or maybe for the ottoman i love it we have made our way back to getting this stuff together so what i'm gonna do is break down these boxes smash up these bags and put all this stuff away first and then and then I'm gonna take these the things that I got from the dollar store and this bin that I was telling y'all about right here and um, put some of this stuff away so that we can start working on putting together the bassinet and all that other stuff. That wasn't too bad. We <laughs> got that corner all together with all the trash. Um, and then I did find a cute little outfit. It wasn't in the trash. I guess that did not just go together well. <laughs> but um, I found this cute little set. It's a, I think it's a burp cloth. It's got a bib a onesie, some towels, all of that. So I'm gonna put that with the rest of this stuff over here that needs to be washed. Okay, and let's figure out how we are about to, how do I wanna structure this? Like, do I wanna take stuff out of boxes? What do, let me figure out how I wanna organize this stuff real quick. It's the progress for me. I organized it in a way that made sense for me. I have all my 
um, breast pumping and breastfeeding stuff over here. So I think I'm gonna just give that its own drawer because it's big, it's like a lot. So we about to tackle this right now. I got my man up here. We about to put together this bassinet. It doesn't look too difficult, but <laughs> it's kind of heavy. So I'm gonna open up um, the box and see what's all in there and pull everything out so y'all can watch us put it together. The whole thing pulls out. Oh, hold on. Come on. I'll hold this down if you pull up. Oh, that don't look like it's going to be hard to put together at all. Let me see the back side of it. It got legs on the. Okay. Okay. Well, I was supposed to be helping, but he just started throwing the thing together so fast. The instructions is right here, and everything is like labeled. One, two, three, and it's just kind of telling you how to put everything together. So these are the legs. And then it says you can adjust the height. So, okay, so this is what we're working with so far. Now, what else back there? Love it that's gonna be so convenient my baby got this all put together but we have these two straps and they super super long and they have this on here so i feel like they just hook into here and i, I just don't know what they're supposed to do like they're not even in this picture so they have them in the manual as like something that's that's in there it's part of the kit but they don't tell you what to do with them on any of these pages so what are we supposed to do with those? Don't be like me, big and out of breath. <laughs> He's, that's a TikTok video. Okay, so we about to put this together. Um, Tootie got me this. It's a swing, and it has like a, so it swings side to side, and it swings front and back, and then it's got some little toys on the top, all of that good stuff. I'm excited to put this together. I'm so anxious to see him in this. So let's do this. Baby, I love you one day. Baby, will someday grow? Till then, I sit my trunk ass on that runway on this one way. Falling out. What? 
How much is left in there? Just a couple? Yeah. Okay. All right, so everything is out. Let's see what we're working with. Yeah, they made us go through hell and hot water just to even find the instructions, but they gave us some screws. Um, this is called an alley wrench. Okay, an alley wrench. And so I'm gonna take these out of here real quick and then we're gonna try to, I guess, the, should we just start with the bottom, the legs and all that first? Okay, come on. Right okay. It's like, no, I can show you bigger things than that. It's gonna be a minute till I'm back. Let me get your images that last. Amex had a limit in the past. I had plenty women in the past. I done plenty sinning in the past. Y'all don't need to know what you can ask. Sticking on your backstage pass. All access, cause you bad. You could go wherever with that ass. Show to the shower, to the truck. Truck to the club for the party. You go in first with your girl. Cause I don't know who's out there watching. But I do know one thing though. Women, they come, they go. Saturday through Sunday, Monday, Monday, Sunday, yo. Maybe I'll love you one day. Maybe we'll someday grow. Till then, I sit my drunk ass on that runway, on this one way.
The swing was definitely way more work than the first one. I mean, not that I helped with the first one, but <laughs> the bassinet. But that was definitely way more work and a little more tedious putting these together, but we did get everything all set up. And it looks good. We gotta get some batteries for it and she'll be all set. So here's my dilemma. Do we just go ahead and put all this stuff together? Cause it's all, um, this one's that starts at zero months. And it's, it turns into all these other things. My cousins here got this. She's loyal. And then we have this sit me up, which he's gonna be able to, you know, move around, sit in. He can sit on the floor or on the counter or something. If I, you know what I'm saying? We also have this, which is a vibrating bouncer. So we put a swing together. This is a smaller version, kinda but it's, it doesn't swing, it vibrates and it bounces. And it's like supposed to be soothing and it's got some toys at the top. And then we have this, it says, kick and play piano gym. So I think I might've had this on my registry. I don't even remember what it looks like. So I'm about to take it out the box, but I'm trying to figure out, should we just go ahead and put all this stuff together and leave it in his room? This one got tore up a little bit. I don't know if that was us or if that was the delivery service but we're gonna put this one together next just because this swing right here is big and it's heavy so i don't feel like we're gonna be able to just tote it up and down the stairs like we want to so we'll probably either leave it up or leave it downstairs but this one is much lighter and much smaller so we're gonna get this one this don't have much in there at all this should be well well did i speak too so hold on Oh, okay. It's got a good amount of little poles up in here. <laughs> Hold up. Stick it in the hole. Stick it in the hole. Oh. Oh, I would have never seen that. <laughs> wow. This one was honestly a breeze. It wasn't hard to put together at all. It was really ABC. <laughs> so we done with this, but we got to take a little bit of a break, y'all, because I'm hungry. I got my phone set up because I'm about to get ready to go on Facebook Live and chat with the people. But we went to the grocery store. Obviously, a big part of nesting is making sure mom and dad are okay. <laughs> so, uh, we went to the grocery store. We went to Sam's and we also went to Walmart. Um, we got all of our waters are still out in the car. Jeremiah got to still bring those in. But um, yeah, we got tissue, paper towels. We also got a set of pots and pans. It comes with, um, yeah, pots, pans, a little skillet, a little thing to make eggs, um, some more things to cook food with, <laughs> silverware, I guess. I mean, you, uh, cooking utensils, a knife set, some foil, some freezer bags because we went to Sam's. Um, I'm gonna go through all of this with them on live, but vinegar, gotta clean meat. Um, I got a pan because I got some cornbread. I got a strainer and then everything else is just groceries. So let me pull all this stuff out the bag and go on live. I used to go on live all the time and do cooking videos and people really, really enjoy them. Sometimes I just be making like a sausage, egg and cheese biscuit in the morning. Sometimes I be making like a full course meal. <laughs> but um, I'm gonna start doing those again. I feel like I don't know if I wanna do them on YouTube shorts or if I wanna do full cooking videos with y'all, but let me know how y'all feel about that. If you made it to this part of the video, let me know how you feel about that. Back to the project. So I'm about to take some Clorox wipes and just wipe this counter up here. Y'all see me clean this out in my cleaning video if you haven't go watch that but this bassinet is in here because we needed a little more room to put the rest of this stuff together the valet trash is about to come so i'm about to take all of this scrap trash that we had from putting this stuff together as well as these boxes downstairs and um i'm about to organize these after i clean off the shelves in the closet i'm gonna put this stuff up there and then i, I like i said i'll just be able to see a little more clearly <laughs> these towels are so freaking little and cute so i took all the towels out the package these are all washcloths these are all dry towels and they have um their hooded dry towels with cute little bears and designs and all kind of other little stuff 
on there. Right here I have books that we got from baby showers and cards. Any of these cards that have money in them, um, I'm taking them and I'm using it to put in his uh, bank accounts and his investments accounts. We got these wipes and I put these off in the corner and then I took these diapers that we have right here and I just put the bigger sizes on the bottom and then the smaller ones on the top. So we have a couple of pack of pa um, size ones, ones, ones twos there's another one there's a two back here and then we got some threes and fours on the bottom of course i'm gonna just take a bunch of newborn diapers from the hospital and then if we need to buy a pack of newborns we will so i wanted to have this for just like when we moving around and everything but i didn't know it had this zipper right here which i feel like maybe i need to put just like a little blanket or something on top of it because i don't want this oh this this is folk <laughs> <laughs> I was like, why they got a zipper right here? That's crazy. Okay, that, that's much better. I went to my P.O. box and I had a couple of more Amazon gifts from my registry. Thank you again, Kim. She got me some more of these breast milk storage bags. So I'm really, really hoping that the body gives what it needs to give. <laughs> so that I can have a good supply. We also got some batteries from, uh, what we go, Target some c batteries and d batteries for the swing um and some of the other stuff that we have put together and then i stopped i'll talk about this stuff when i pack my hospital bag oh yeah if it was anything i was waiting for it was this okay this is the perfect way to finish this nesting video this freaking car seat slash stroller has come and y'all i'm let me let me unbox this because i'm so fucking excited I'm outside in an AMG, right outside, TT, two-turn baby girl, you know me, still with the girls that I grew beside, all the niggas around me, right here they got, gotta watch the time, cause I have the things for me right here, um, I am gonna go to the store, because I'm missing just a couple of things, but I have the Freedom Mom Perry bottle, I also have the foaming, like, um, witch hazel healing foam yeah perineal y'all know what i was trying to say <laughs> and then i got some nipple cream um dermaplast 
I have some big drawers that I got from Walmart <laughs> and also some big pads that I got from Walmart. These are um, like the overnight maxis because I want them to be literally as comfortable as possible. And then I got these medicated pads. I was going to get the tux, but um, a lot of the girls on TikTok said they like these better and they really just, they have the same um, benefits. So I just got the Target brand. I'm getting my baby stuff together. So I have onesies, I have socks, I have hats, mittens, all of that good little stuff. Um, I have these travel size washes. I know they're gonna have wash there, but um, these are just two of them that came in like a little kit that somebody got me off Amazon. And then of course I have my big ones for home. Something I'm figuring out as a mom. So like I have newborn stuff, which is this, this stuff right here. And then I have a bunch of zero to three month stuff, but I don't know how much he's gonna weigh exactly because they say like the weight from the ultrasound is never really accurate so a lot of these clothes in here are um so a lot of these clothes in here are zero to three months and i'm like should i bring zero to three months stuff or should i just bring all newborn stuff because i don't know i also think i'm gonna bring the comb and the brush out of here again things i know that they're gonna have but i don't know and then there's a nail file as well as a nail clip so everybody was telling me to bring mittens but i'm like I wanna just cut his nails right off the bat. One of the last things we gotta do is actually put Duna into the car. So this is the base that it comes with. We just got all the stickers on there and everything so we can make sure we put it in there properly. And somebody got us this little mirror um, for you to be able to see into the back seat from the driver's seat. I think it's, I don't know, I'm gonna have to figure out. We're gonna figure this part out. All right, so the base is in. And we got the car seat on top. Now we're going to play with taking it in and out of the car real quick. Um, we have the base and these little hook things in the back. So we don't need the seat belt is what the directions were saying. So we're going to pull all this stuff off of here now that we done got this all in here. So we got it all in there. We've been playing with it back and forth to see how to take it out and put it back in real fast and turn it into a stroller. So we got that. I'm about to put this little mirror on here. Packing my shower bag well my like stuff to leave the hospital in and whatnot so i got some sweatpants i got my head scarf i got a bra some q-tips um i didn't want to put my whole thing of eco styler gel in there so i'm just bringing some mousse and a brush i already have a ponytail holder in my hair everybody kept saying get chapstick because <laughs> i guess your lips gonna be dry so i got some vaseline right here i'm about to take this little piece of soap out of there and replace it with a new bar um i also um uh, have a thing of lotion downstairs because we've been using this big one in the house um upstairs like after we shower and stuff but there's a smaller one that i'm gonna bring because this one is like the family size and it's heavy and then i also I also have this sports bra that I never um, ended up wearing. I got it from a Nike outlet before I was pregnant. Um, and then I got a white t-shirt that I'm going to just put with these sweatpants to leave into the hospital with. So We have the diaper bag and then we have our shower bag. Um, this is the Nike bag that we used when we was at truck stops. As y'all know, we are truck drivers. So we been had um, shower flip flops on deck. Everybody was like, no bare feet in the shower. I'm like, y'all, we, we, we ain't new to this. Okay, very true to this. And so we got our shower flip flops and then I'm about to pack my stuff in here and then let Jeremiah come put his stuff on the other side. And I think we are gonna be all ready to go.